YouTube, what's good, YouTube? What's good? What is going on? My smell good family. How y'all, man? How you doing? Hopefully you guys are good. Hopefully you're great. Hopefully positive energy and positive vibes are all around you and those who you love as well, man. You know how we give it up here. Positive vibes only, only, okay? All right, man. So uh, today I want to do a quick video, man. I got lucky. Um, going to my local Ross, man, I kind of came up. It's been a while since I've been able to do something like this. Not because I haven't... Not because I can't, it's because there ain't been nothing there. <laughs> ain't been nothing there. And I'm um, very excited to get into this video. Okay, so um, if you are not a part of Smell Good Family and you would like to become a part of it, very, very simple. Number one, it's free 99, not a dime. Number two, just hit subscribe, like the video, and meet me down below in the comments so we can talk about what you love and what I love. And that is fragrances, okay? So cheapy haul video from my local Ross. Got extremely lucky. Um, I was leaving the gym and where I work out at, there's a Ross right across the street. So typically when I leave the gym, I always, yeah, pretty much always stop by there when I leave the gym just to see if there's a gym or something in there that I can get my hands on. And lately ain't been nothing in there, man. I may have come out with something here, something there, but nothing like this, man. So I got real excited, man, when I, you know, got over to Ross and, you know, I was negative going in there. I was negative saying, man, I know it ain't nothing really in here. Let me just see. And when I walked in, I was dead wrong. I was dead wrong. So we have seven fragrances that we picked up from Ross, man. I'm not going to go into notes or details or anything like that. Just kind of give a quick, um, a quick thought you know about the fragrance and we'll get more in depth to them when i do reviews uh on these uh a little later on okay so let's go ahead and jump into it up first from the house of hugo boss all right we have hugo boss reversed reversed all right so this one is still in the box because this is my backup bottle all right so i have another full 4.2 ounce bottle of hugo boss reverse here it is right here on deck all right so safe to say i'll have hugo boss reversed uh, for a lifetime uh, is you know a fragrance that I enjoy it smells really really good and um, I'm hearing this discontinue and if that's the case to get a 125 ml bottle of this stuff for $29.99 you can't beat that you can't beat that so I just had to grab it and keep it on ice okay because that's a fragrance I you know spray out the shower if I'm running errands you know just I use it more regular than you know like you know a Creed or or my Chanel's or something like that. So had to get a backup bottle on deck, all right? Up next from the House of Coach, all right? One I had been eyeing for quite some time. Was hoping to find it in a rack store, get a pretty decent deal on it. And uh, there it was, at my local Ross from the House of Coach. All right, we have Coach Blue. Coach Blue, Coach Blue, all right? So this is a very nice scent. And the reason these are out of the box is because I just couldn't wait. <laughs> so I went ahead and popped them open and smelled them. And uh, this one is nice. Um, I know what this was gonna be for. It's gonna just be a versatile, everyday scent for me. Um, especially, like I said, going to the gym, running errands, going to the barbershop, post office, whatever I need to do, this is the one I would grab. Just wanna throw something on to smell good. Not to impress or anything like that, but mainly for me, I'll throw this on, walk out the door. If I get a compliment along the way, cool, all right? So very happy to add this 50 ml for this. I paid $24.99 for this 50 ml. I thought that was a good enough deal. Pull the trigger on it, add it to the collection. All right. Next up from the house of Hollister. All right. Shout out to my smell good family member, man, who suggested this and threw me the alley up. Forgive me. I can't think of your name right now, but uh, meet me down in the comments so you can get your rightful respect for throwing this alley oop, man. And uh, I said the next time I seen wave two, I would grab it. And that's what I did from Hollister. We have wave two. Wave two. This stuff is real good, y'all. It's real good. It's in the wheelhouse of that Invictus uh, type style, Invictus Aqua, original Invictus. Kind of combine, you know, those two, You the Invictus and Invictus Aqua kind of combine in this bottle. So I love Rosasi Hawass, uh, First Instinct Together by Abercrombie & Fitch. This is right in that wheelhouse. I wore this out the shower the other night and um, it was great. <laughs> it was great. I was really impressed with what came out of this bottle. Not a big time performer. I don't have it for that. I have it for what I just mentioned it for. So I'm um, glad to add this to the collection. Another, you know, Invictus style fragrance for $19.99. Sign me right on up from the House of Hollister. We got Wave 2. 
wave two. All right, moving along to the from the house of Mont Blanc. I believe Ross from over at uh, TGL TLTG Reviews. I'll be one day I'm gonna get it right, Ross. He probably don't mess with me no more, but <laughs> one day I'm gonna get it right. Um, but uh, this is from the house of Mont Blanc. I saw his video. Ross was talking about it. Got me intrigued. I saw it for 20 bucks. Picked it up. 75, 75 ml bottle of Mont Blanc's Presence Cool. Presence Cool. All right. This is a very clean, just super clean scent. Super clean. I would definitely, you know, be. Yeah, man, just clean. It's just clean. Got that funky blue juice in here. But this is something I would definitely, you know, wear to the gym. Fresh out of shower. Most of these I'll be doing that with, but this is definitely a gym scent. <laughs> Get it around the neck a few times, spray my hoodie a couple times, and I'm out the dough. I'm out the dough. So from the house of Mont Blanc, glad to have this one. It's kind of like around the well uh, in the same warehouse of uh, Nautica Blue. Yeah, like Nautica Blue. All right, and I went Nautica Blue to the gym. All right, so glad to have another gym scent in the rotation from the house of Mont Blanc. We got Presence Cool. Presence cool, if we're gonna get in focus. <laughs> Presence cool, there we go, there we go. All right, next up are these three. Man, these are great. All right, I'm gonna save my favorite pickup last. All right, next up, I've been looking for this one for a long time. I could have been pulled the trigger for it, but you know, I knew I would find it in the rack store eventually, and I did find it in Ross that day from the house of Versace. We got Versace main au fraiche. Oh, fresh. All right. This is a legend in the community. A summertime steal, a summertime legend, a warm, hot weather fragrance. And I was glad to see this and I grabbed it. Um, 50 ml. This was around $34.99. Yeah, $34.99 for this 50 ml. I tested it out and it's exactly what everybody says it is. Very musky, aromatic, uh, slight, slightly sweet, fruity type of fragrance that star note and that must kind of really colliding in here with some other notes that i have to get to know um, when i spend some time with it but i do like what i smell coming out of it right along that saint kitts and saint bart's um star walker type of feel they don't smell like each other but just that type of feel glad to have this because i have been looking for it it's always good when you find something that's been on your list in a rack store it just gives you a good feeling all right so from the house of versace maine we have Versace Main or Fresh. Oh, Fresh. All right. All right. Two more left on the list. These, these two are more gravitated towards cooler weather or evening outings. Um, you can get away with wearing both of these in the summer, especially if you're going on a date or something real cozy in the evening time when the sun is down. It's not extremely hot. First up, I was glad to add this, and I feel like it was kind of only right to add it to the collection from the house of Dolce Cabana. A big steal, all right? We have Dolce Gabbana, the one EDT. EDT. I hear a lot of love um, for this fragrance, and I've never had it on my radar or on my list, but I will say this. When I smelled it yesterday, I was really impressed. I was really impressed because I do enjoy the EDP. I think the EDP is, you know, right along with uh, La Nuit de Lome is probably a no-brainer day fragrance out here in the community maybe one and two uh for you know a broad you know spectrum of fragrance lovers those two are great well this one right here i enjoy as well of course similar to the uh edp because this is the originator so the edp kind of mocked this but this is more brighter a little bit more fresher a little bit more in your face um, I think it's due to the EDP being just a more richer oil concentration. That's why it's more reserved, a little bit more heavy, has a little bit more depth um, than this one, all right? But I look forward to spending some time with this and really kind of gathering some data to see if I would prefer this over the EDP. So we'll see, stay tuned for that. So caught this, this is the most expensive one, $44.99 at my local Ross. We have Dolce Cabana's, the one, the one the one all right last but not least my favorite pickup of the day obviously just due to the smell i also saw ross review this on his channel and uh just blown away man just really blown away the way he smelled it and what he paid for versus what he got paid for with what he got he was really happy and when i see people have reactions like that when i watch fragrance reviews i say yeah i need to check that out i need to check that out and boy 
was he right from the house of diesel yes we have diesel only the brave tattoo only the brave tattoo funky style bottle got the fist with the diesel ring on it um you know the silver top you know just real funky Parker Robinish, uh style fragrance but boy when i tell you the juice that's in here is really good man you get this apple and tobacco type note gourmandish type vibe with this fragrance i was stunned stunned to smell what came out of here and to be real with you to be real with you, like it really smells like um, polo red, like the intense, not the extreme, the intense, like the polo red intense. That's what it remind me of, like the apple and tobacco. I don't, I know it's not tobacco in uh, polo red intense. I don't think, but just similar. I got polo red intense vibes. That's what I'm looking for, uh, vibes, man. This stuff is great, and it, and it also smells like uh, John Varvatos um, XX. John Varvatos XX. Look at me. <laughs> John Varvatos XX. It gives off those vibes as well. But all that to say, this is good stuff. This is good stuff for sure, and I can't wait to see what it's all about. All right? So, yeah, man. Those are seven fragrances that I picked up at my local Ross. A little cheapy haul. Haven't done that in a while because I haven't been able to because there's been nothing there. So, I appreciate the opportunity to do that. And, um, yeah, hopefully I can do it again soon. <laughs> all right? So, ain't nothing like... You know, getting fragrances for cheap, all right? So all of these got them for good prices. And um, seven for seven, I'll take that for sure, all right? So we'll get more in depth and get more reviews on these later. So appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you for stopping by once again. Until next time, take care of yourselves, man. Be cool, be safe. And um, I'll see you guys on the next fragrance video. Smell good, family. Appreciate y'all.